Okay, all good? Hear me again? Yes, Okay. Taken. Where were we up to? So we're down there here, here. test the brake, we've done that, yeah. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to check the instruments from right, over here, over at these, these that's They're the mount green. Green, 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 green. You've got to check for green. Yeah. Must be, otherwise there's something wrong. Next we're going to check the mags on and off at 1800 revs. So that's increase the power. That's it, keep the hand just resting on the brake just in case, yeah. Increase the power to 1800 revs. Yep. Then turn one off, one mag off. Back on. Yep, then back on again. It didn't shake. Next one. Just didn't shake. Put it back on again. And while we've got the power on, we pull the carby heater out. You should see a little drop there. Very small. Oh, okay, yeah. Put it back in again. And then bring the power back to normal. That's it. Okay, what's the next one? Left out. So, no, we've done carby heater. What's the next one? Fuel pump on. That's it. That's a, that's the back one. Just yep. that, make sure it works. We're going to clear the air from left to right. Make sure there's no one sitting down on the end of the runway. Yeah. And there's no one on this side. Looks yep. okay to me. And looking at the windsock, that's yep. going to tell us which way we're going to take off. It's into the wind. Uh, into the wind. So we the way to simple way to remember: always fly into the small hole. Okay. You're going to take off up the small hole of the, of the windsock. That's how I remember it. Yeah. Okay? So that's going to be runway 19, isn't it? Yes. Therefore, we go this way, make a turn and... No, we're going to go down here. Yeah. Turn left. And then turn around at the other end there and take off this way. We're going to fly up to the, okay, yeah. into the small hole. Yeah, got Which it. is runway 19. Yeah. Okay? So the call is going to be... Traffic Murray Bridge, WX, entering and backtracking runway 19. Yep, that's it. So make the call. Traffic Murray Bridge, W5246, entering and backtracking runway 19, traffic Murray Bridge. Good, away we go. Put it away. Now, as, we, as we move, I'll just show you what I do. Yep. I do this, just as we start to move, put the right foot in. Have a look down there, nothing coming in. While we're still on this concrete block, we're not on the runway yet. Yeah. Look down there, nothing coming in. Oh. All good, let's go. Your airplane, now away you go. There. We're going to go left, yes. We can go a little bit faster, just a little bit, not much. That's it, round you come. Looking up the runway again, no one coming. Good. No. If somebody was coming in here, they have, they they have the right to land. Yeah. That we would go into the grass over here and get out of their way. Oh, okay. Okay. So the runway is between the white cones over there, and the white cones on this side. Yeah. That's the yeah. whole runway. Yeah. But we're we have to go behind those cones if someone so was coming in toward us. Yeah. Get your feet working. Go over to the left left hand edge and just try using your feet a little bit. Keep it going, keep it going, keep going, right over to the left. Keep going. Now just keep it straight there. Hold it there, that's good. Keep it straight. Good. No, keep it straight there, that's it. Go across to the right hand side. We're just practicing. Yep. That's all. Keep coming, a bit more. A bit more, keep it straight there. That's it. Go go left again. I'm just getting you to use your feet. Yeah. Doesn't have to be sudden, does it? Just nice and gentle. Keep it straight there. Good. We'll stay here now. A lot of things to think about, aren't there? It is. <laughs> it's good for your brain. I think Mike gets sometimes frustrated with me. Yeah. That's okay. <laughs> no, we all get frustrated. Yeah. Trust me, we do. I believe it. So we're going to do a left hand turn around here. Yeah. And we never stop on the gravel, ever. Yeah. Because of the, the propeller will damage on the sign. Just now slow it down just a little bit. Bit of right foot, push your right foot in. That's it. Keep it coming around. Don't stop it. Don't stop it. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. All the way to the middle. Keep it rolling. We're not going to stop. So you can leave your hand off the brake now. Yeah. So you hold the stick now. 
Now, I'm just having a last check, the flaps are set. Yep. The fuel pump is on. Yep. Green, 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 green. We're yep. good to go. We're going to stay in the middle of the runway. Yep. Which is over here to the right a bit more. Keep it about there. That's what it looks like. Yep. And the plane will want to go left. Yep. So you have to use a bit of right foot to stop it going there. Yep. So ease the power on. I'll come with you. Just ease the power on. Ease. Push, 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 push. Not hard. Just ease it on. Not too hard. Sit there. And at 40 knots, we're going to lift the nose. We'll just off. Bring the stick back a bit more. A bit more. Hold. Just hold it there. Relax your arm. Bit, bit of right foot. Keep it there. Keep it there. That's good. There we go. We're flying. Beautiful. Not too steep, doesn't it? Pretty yep. steep. We want about 70 knots. That's that's okay. about the picture there. Whatever that looks like out the front to you. That's about right. Why does it always want to go to the left? Because the engine's turning to the left. Oh, okay. So it's pulling you around that way. Yeah. So we're now 400 foot off the ground, so we can put the flaps up. 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 Yep. Then we're going to turn and do a left-hand turn here. Yep. You see that island in the middle of the river over there? Yeah. Aim toward that. We can turn the fuel pump off as well if you want. That's it now. Good. About there, so straighten it up. That's good. Keep it straight. And we want to pitch it up a little. We can still. We're doing 90 knots. We can pitch it up a little stronger, and we can go faster. Oh, okay. There we are, 1,200, that's where we want to be. Yep. I call this attitude. Yep. Bring the power back to 1,800. No, 2,800, I'm sorry. Keep going a bit more, a bit more. About there. And then we're going to do a left-hand turn. There you go, left. Traffic Murraybridge, Jabiru 5246, downwind uh, 19 Murraybridge. Now look at your hand, you're really tight. You, you've got, watch okay. this, try and do this. Let go of that stick for a minute. Two fingers. Yeah. No more. Don't grab it. Right? Two fingers. What, I'm not being personal here. Now hold it. Yeah. <laughs> now, you're not going to grab it now, are you? No. That's, it should be that light. Okay. You don't want this. That's really hard. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm going to teach you something in a minute. We're going to prove something to you. We're going to head out to the north today, right? So we just head this way. Yeah. Traffic Murray Bridge, Jabiru 5246, departing downwind 19 on climb 2500, tracking north Murray Bridge. Okay. What I want you to do is I want you to take your hand off the stick, yeah. hand off the throttle, and fold your arms. And if the, if the wing drops a little bit, don't, don't touch it, <laughs> the plane can fly itself. It doesn't need you. This is what I'm trying to get you to relax. Yeah. And we'll flop around and it'll go all over the place, but no, I'm here too. It's not easy, I know. No. You, you, you drive a motor car, don't you? Yeah. And you want to hold the wheel. Yeah. You don't need to. That's right, no, won't do. You're not going to jump out of the air. How about this? Now we're going down a bit. That doesn't matter. It'll pick its speed. We'll come up again in a minute. We can go all the way out here. Yeah. Not touch it. This is a confidence builder. Okay? Yeah. We don't need to hold the controls. Well, we, we have our hands resting on them. Yeah. In flight, but we don't. That's okay. Just the wind. I'm not doing anything. You're not doing anything. No. So the lesson is that the aeroplane will fly itself. Yeah. It doesn't need us. It's an aeroplane. It flies. Yeah. What it does need is us to get it back to the airfield. Okay. Right? But other than that, we're jumping around here. I know we are. But we're still heading towards the river. Yeah. 
we're at 1,500 feet. And all we're doing is letting the air, which is bouncy today, bounce us around. Because we can't do anything about the bounces, other than just relax. Yeah. It's a weird feeling, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> but w it's once you realise that now we're going this way, aren't we? Yeah. So use your right foot just a little bit. Just, just touch it. Not much. There it is. And now it's going to go that way. That's okay. That, <laughs> see, that's not going to fix it. <laughs> you're, not, you, you're strapped in, aren't you? Yep. So we can't fall out of the plane. I, I, you have to trust me. Yeah, no. I know. I'm not, I'm not here to frighten you. I want you to understand the aircraft doesn't need us. And it will just keep on flying. Does so it flip over if it is jumps too much? It cannot flip over. No? No. no. It, it's literally physically impossible. If the plane was to go that much, yeah. it would bring itself back again. I've never had it happen, but if it did, yeah. that's what's going to happen. So now, I want to go around to the right a little bit, don't touch anything, just use a bit of right foot at the moment, just a little bit, and she'll start to turn. See it coming around? Yeah. That's all we're using, we're not holding... This is not going to save our lives. Okay. <laughs> That's just a control. Now straighten it up with your left foot, a little bit, not much. Yes. We're going to hit straight up this way. you realise that the plane can fly itself, yeah. not too bad is it? Every, what you were doing, every student does. You, yeah. you, you're not alone. But once you've done this for thousands and thousands of hours, you realise it doesn't really make much difference. You just sit here and relax. Yeah, but this one just the wings, right? That keeps the wings straight and level, but can you see the plane can do it without you? Yeah. You don't need to have a death grip on the, on the stick. Yeah. It's not going to fix it. And once you start to realise that you can do small movements, and in a relaxed way, yeah. you can then start to enjoy flying. Look out the window. <laughs> That's why you're learning to fly. Yeah. Look out the window. Right? Because the plane's fine, isn't it? Yeah, it, it is, yeah. We haven't touched anything yet. Yeah. And we're slowly coming up. Yeah. One, we're now at 1,800 feet. There's the River Murray. Yeah. You look out the window and think, well, it's not too bad. No. Oh. Yeah, you can see outside here. Yeah. <laughs> uh, nothing else to see. I mean, every now and again, I look at the instruments to make sure they're okay. I'm looking sure we've got plenty of fuel. Okay. That, one, that one's full, that one's not. Okay. And we're just enjoying ourselves. Yeah. So... I hope that's one lesson that you can yeah. take on board, right? Now, if, for example, if a, I don't know, a, a plane was coming towards us the other way, yeah. or a, a flock of birds was in front of us, of course we'd have to use this and get out of the way quickly, wouldn't we? Yeah. That's where this comes in. Okay. But you always fly with your hand on it and relaxed. Because yeah. all these lumps and bumps, this is not going to fix it. I mean, if the wing, I'm just going to bank the wing over that way a little bit. Yeah. So, now the wing's over there. I pushed it there, didn't I? Yeah. But now I don't want to do that, I push it back again. One finger, look. Yeah. That's all it takes. So, what I want you to take away today, if nothing else, is be relaxed. Yeah. About the aeroplane. I mean, if you get a turbulent day, it bounces around. Nothing you can do about it. It's just the air. Now, if we go up another, I don't know, another thousand feet, it most probably will be smoother up there. Yeah. Because the air is different layers. So now we're going to climb. So we're how many feet are we at the moment? How much? It, what's our reading there at the moment? Uh, 190. 1,900. Yeah. So we're nearly at 2,000, aren't yeah. we? Two o'clock. Okay? So now I want to keep going straight ahead. Yeah. And I want to go up to 3,000 feet. So we're at 2,000 now, right? Yeah. So now to go up, we need power, yeah. and we can also pull the stick back to push us up that way, yeah. to pitch us up that way, and we normally climb up at about 80 knots. So increase the power, that's it, and then pitch the nose up, that's it, was all the way in, good. Yeah. And here we go, we're going up now. Yeah. 
1,200. Yep. And we're going up nearly at 1,000 feet a minute. Okay. And feel, feel the pressure in there. You can trim it to hold it there for you. So hold it there, about yep. there. There we are, 80 knots. Now, have, as you have now, just keep your hand relaxed there. Yeah. But we're climbing, and we can change the pitch until we're doing 80. Where's the 80? Here it is, yeah. coming up now, right? So we can trim it to hold it there. And we've just got our hand nicely relaxed, just in case we need it. Yeah. Notice it's smoother up here now? Yeah. When we get up to 3,000, it could be even better. Is it always smoother higher? Sometimes, sometimes it's not. So when we get to 3000, which we're nearly up to now, yeah. I call it attitude, so that can get nose down, yeah. to about there. Bring the power back to 2800. <laughs> That's it. So you don't really have any pressure in here. You can just about let it go. There we are. But we are going down a little bit. That's it. So we can trim it, pull it back a little bit, and trim it back a little bit. Okay. Very small movement. This is your autopilot. Yeah. <laughs> right? And here we're at 3,000. Nice and smooth, isn't it? Yeah. But again, you're not doing much, are you? No. You're not controlling. Yeah. You can over control too much, and that's not going to be good. So now, um, I don't know what's out that way. I want to go over there to the hills. Yeah. All the hills, that's a nice gentle turn to the left. That's it, just gentle, no, no rush. Lovely. No gripping now. See that? Yeah. That's, you've changed that, that's good. That's how your hand has to be for the rest of your life. Okay. Because <laughs> <laughs> the minute I see white knuckles, I know this is happening. And what happens if you have your hand tight like that, is you can't, that locks up, you can't move properly. Okay, yeah. This is nice and easy to move, right? So we're going to hit for those white silos over there. Yeah. Nice and right, isn't it? Yeah. And look out the window. Nice, it's nice, yeah. yeah. Because part of what you need to do is make sure that we don't bump into other aircraft. Yeah. So you've always got to keep a lookout outside, not in here, we'll look outside for other aeroplanes. So when we get to those silos, that's it. You're holding your height, yeah. you're not going up or down. Perfect turn. Just a little bit too much left foot, just put a little bit of right foot in. That ball should stay here in the middle. Okay. Roughly in the middle, that's it. If you are running out of the middle, because yep. you push your feet too much, does this one fix it if you move it? Well, we're going we're gonna to play with that in a minute. There's, okay. there's two parts to that, which I'll show you in a moment. I just want you to get relaxed and yeah. enjoy. You can see some silos way out there in the distance, two white ones. Yeah. On the horizon, yeah, aim towards that. So let's talk about the rudder, which is what our feet are yeah. uh, moving, and the ailerons, which are those things on the end of the wings, right? Yeah. If you do a perfect turn, yeah. that ball will stay in the middle. Roughly. Yeah. If it's half a ball out, it's not a problem. But if the ball goes right out, then you'll start to feel sick and your passengers will be sick. Okay. It's one of the causes of um, uh, air sickness. Yeah. When the ball is not, we call it coordinated. The ball Arrow is traffic, Gabbaroo 4971 is entering and backtracking runway um, 19. So what I want you to do is, I want you to aim for that those silos out the front yeah. there. Have them sort of on the nose. And then what I want you to do is, I want you to bank the aircraft to the left, you know, fairly steeply, and tell me what happens to the bubble on the nose here, like the, on the on the aircraft, the, the, yeah. the little bulge there. Yeah. So if you push that push that stick left, what you tell me which way the ah, see it went that way. 
Tighten it up again. Tighten it up. You tell me, I'll push it. You tell me. Over here, 3,500 turns. Cracking the momentum. Very rich traffic. Okay. Um, that, that bulge in the nose of the yeah. thing, you, it'll go that way. You watch. See it went there? Oh, yeah. Right? Yeah. So its first move is to go that way. That's the. F eventually okay. it'll start to turn. Watch what happens to the ball when I do that. Yeah. Goes that way, doesn't it? Yeah. Into the turn. Now, we're still aiming forward here. This time I want you to push the left rudder in. And tell me which way the nose goes. Straight that way. Yeah. Now come back again. Straight the back again. Yeah. So, the rudder is going to turn the plane that way. Yeah. So the rudder's needed to turn us. Yeah. When we bank the aircraft... <coughs> When we bank the aircraft over, the nose wants to go the other way. Yeah. So we have to have the right amount of rudder and the right amount of bank for the ball to stay in the middle, roughly. Yeah. Okay? My airplane just for a minute, and I'll show you what I mean. So you watch the ball. I'll start to do a turn. Is it staying in the middle? Yeah. Perfect, right? Yeah. Come out of it again. Bit of right foot. You'll feel my foot. Yeah. Feel it. And the stick come back and the ball stays in the middle. Okay. If I don't do that, if I just bank it, watch the ball. About the rudder. The ball will start to fall. No, it's in a turn now. Yeah. Use the foot to come out with. Maybridge traffic, Jabiru 4971 is rolling on the 19 traffic Maybridge. Whatever you do, don't... Say, don't just keep staring at the ball. Look outside, obviously, because they're the yeah. clue. But you'll notice that if you don't have the right amount of aileron yeah. and the right amount of rudder, the ball, the, the aircraft, instead of doing a nice turn like that, is doing this. Yeah. It's skidding. Yeah. We don't want to do that. that. That'll make you feel sick. Okay. Over a long time, right? So you, your control, your aeroplane again. So you do one to the right this time, come around to the right. So we're going to bank it over to the right yeah. and use your right foot. Here comes the nose nicely around, look, see that? Yeah. So we're not skidding. Ball's in the middle. Now come back the other way. Too much, too much left foot then, that's okay. It's very, very small, very small movements. Don't go around to the left. Ball's out one side, usually you can use your foot, the other foot, to push it back in again. Yeah. There it is there. Come round to the right. Nice and smooth, there it is, look at that ball, look, perfectly in the middle. Keep coming round to the right. Nice and smooth. Keep, keep coming round to the right. There it is there. Yeah. So all the movements, Usually a smooth, nice and smooth and nice and gentle. Now can straighten it up again. Yeah. If it's, see how it's out to the right? Just push that right foot in. Step on the ball, whichever side's out, yeah. and there it is perfect again. In very small movements. Okay? Yeah. There's a lesson for you. And that, that is something you have to think about for the rest of your flying life. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you fly a jumbo jet, they don't have to worry about that too much. They don't care. No, but the small planes, <laughs> we have to do it. Okay? Yeah. Right. Now I want to climb up to 3,500. 5, 2, 4, 6, 4, 9, 7, 1, radio check-in. Yeah, 5, 2, 4, 6, ready, Thanks for that, Fives, as well. Um, so I want to go position. Uh, we're about uh, 10 miles to the west. At 3,000. And I want to turn left while I'm doing it, so I'm going to be a climbing turn. Yeah. Okay, so you think about that. Take your time, no rush. So we pitch it up, that's right, and we yeah. can climb it about 80 knots, so we can keep steep, pitch it up until it's about 8, there it is there. That's it. Not too steep, doesn't have to be steep. A little bit more right foot. That is the yeah. ball. There we are. In a perfectly balanced turn. And we're climbing. Yeah. Yeah? So when we're 
nearly at 3,500. We're there, nearly there. Yep. We straighten it up. Get a right foot, right stick. Uh, that's it. And bring the power back. 2,800. We're at 3,500. The right. Yep. So we want to go to 4,000 feet now, and we want to climb to the right. Yep. Come round to the right. While you're doing it, full power, that's it. Start your turn. We want to come round to the right. Yep. Make it more. And about there. That's it. Lovely. We can pitch it up a little bit more. We want to do 80. That's it. Keep turning. Keep turning. Lovely. Very nice. We're nearly there, so stop the turn. Attitude, get the picture, that, that picture we call it the attitude, what it looks like out the front. Power back, you did that well, good. And then trim it to hold that there for you. Out there, yeah, good. And whatever, see the horizon out there? Yeah. Wherever that horizon sits, in relation to the bonnet, yep. whatever that picture looks like to you is a perfect position. What we don't want is looking like that. Yep. Because we're starting to climb. Yep. And we don't want to look like that because we'll start coming down. Yep. We want it to look something like there. This takes a little while to catch up. Perfect. Yep. So we're doing 90 knots, about 180 kilometers an hour. How do, we, how do we go down? Power off first. Yeah, we'll bring back the power. Good. And now start a turn to the right. Bring back the power a little bit more. About there, that's it. Ball's in the middle, which is good. Yeah. And we're coming down, aren't we? Yeah. And we'll come down to 3,500. Very nice. Look at the ball. Yeah. You should be proud of that. That's good. <laughs> Right? Very nice turn. Perfect turn. Okay. So we're nearly there, aren't we? Yeah. So now we can increase the power. Get the power back. St stop the turn. Nice and smooth, that's it. Perfect. Keep it there. 2,800. Uh, the, the revs here, 2,800. Get the yep. picture right. About yep. there. Let go of the stick. Yay! Who's a good girl? Who's a good girl? <laughs> Just, we want to descend again to 3,000 feet. So we're at 3,500. Yep. Want to come down to 3,000 to the left. So want yep. to go down to 3,000 uh, to 3,000 to the left. Yep, that's it. Nice turn. Doesn't have to be rushed. We're not in a hurry. Now I want to trick you, I want to start climbing to the right now. I want to climb up to the right. Does it power on first? Yeah, nice. yeah power, that's it. And turn at the same time, up to the right. Around to the right. Make it over to the right. That's it, over you come. Keep coming. Ball's a little bit out, bit of right foot, not much more. There it is there. Yeah. Perfect. Climb up at 80, which is good. Level? Uh, 3,500, yep. Yes, you've got the power worked out, that's good. That's exactly what you should have done about, that's it, 2,000, yep. a bit more. Out there, that's fine. Perfect. We don't want to stop. No. Otherwise the plane's going to fall, isn't it? Yep. The engine will still keep going. It's, it's the wings losing their lift. Yeah. Really is what the stall's going to be about. So I'm going to show you what it looks like. We're not going to do one today. But I want you to start thinking about what you'd have to do if you were to get a stall. Yeah. Okay? Now, there are certain, um, certain, uh, what's the word I'm looking for, uh, things that happen in the plane. First of all, you'll find, my, my airplane just for yeah. a minute, you'll find this hand will be back here. Yeah. 
right? So the minute you feel the tension back here, whoa, hang on, this is not right. Your brain's got to stop this. Yeah. Don't do this. This is, We're going to stall. This is dangerous. That's what you've got to tell yourself, right? Yeah. I, I won't put you in the stall. But, so that's the first warning. Yeah. The second warning is we've got a stall warning on the yeah. wing. And have you heard it make a noise? Yeah, I did. Whee! That's, you've got about five knots before the stall's going to happen. So the stall warning starts before oh, okay. the stall. It's, it's coming. Yeah. Be, be ready. That's what it's telling you, right? Yeah. So I'm just going to show you what one would look like, wh yeah. what the picture would look like, but we won't actually stall. Okay, I'll just do a couple of things here. Have a good look around, make sure there's no one around us, no one houses underneath us. Engine is all green, so we're good, so I can show you what to do. So what hap What we will teach you to do is this. We'll progressively slow the plane down, and we bring the stick back. You'll hear the warning go in a minute. There it is. Yeah. All you have to do is put the nose down, put the power on, yeah. and fly away. That's all it is. That's the re that the reaction has to be. We don't want. We don't have. I'm going to push the nose forward very quickly, so don't jump. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we don't want to do this. We yeah. don't want to do that. There's no need to do that. All we want to do is stop the back pressure that's causing this. Let's just do it again. I'm pulling. You you have your hand. You feel what I'm doing. Yeah. I'm pulling it right back. All we're going to do is stop that some power on and fly away. That's all the reaction's got to be. Bring it back, bring it back, bring it back. Feel how far it is now? This is yeah. wrong. This shouldn't be there. Wings are level. There it is. Yeah. Fly away. How long actually do you have to fix it? Well, if you don't fix it, one wing will drop. Yeah. And, and again, I'm, I don't want to frighten you, but just, I'm going to drop that wing just for a minute, right? Yeah. Just so you get a feel. It'll go like this. Whack. Okay. Very quickly. That in itself is quite okay. Yeah. Because we've got a little bit of time. If we didn't fix it, we'd get into a spin. Oh, yeah. And that's not... Yeah. Not allowed to do it. So, when it happens, the times that I see it happen most of all are... Uh, when people are in the circuit, when they're coming into land, and they start doing some turns very slow. Yeah. So, as you can see, when we're doing these stalls, we're fairly slow, aren't we? Yeah. So we're doing 50 knots. Doesn't want to stall. There you go. But nevertheless, um, so they're coming and they're slow and they do a turn, and they lose more lift in a turn, and over she goes. And the plane will zip over real quick. But again, it's how you react to it is the is the is the yeah. is the fix, if you will. I don't ever want you to be in a store. I'm teaching you how to get out of one. Yeah. Don't ever, I don't want you to practice getting into this no, on your no. own. That's the, not the idea of what we're trying to teach you here. So what happens is, if we if one of those wings was to drop, yeah. Then all we need to do, we don't need to use this at all. The, the, the control, we just use our foot. I'm going to push the wing over that side, yeah. and I want you to gently pick it up with your uh, with your right foot. So I'm just going to, we're not going to fall out, it's quite safe. We go over there, yeah. now we are, we're starting to turn, now use your right foot, right foot, right foot, right foot, look what happens. Okay, yeah. You lift up the wing. And if it goes too far that way, just use the other foot. Yeah. Okay, or if, it, if the wing dropped this way, like that, use your left foot, So your feet, your rudder, yeah. can lift us back up again. What everyone does when they panic, when the wing has gone over there, like yeah. that, is they use this to bring it back with. No, 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 no. You must use your foot. That is dangerous. It'll make the stall worse. Oh, okay. Okay, so your instinct, oh, it's gone that way. Yeah. I'll bring it back. Don't ever do that in a stall. So the answer is, when it banks over one way, like that, here we go, starts to spin, 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 use your right foot, push it back, up it comes. Yeah. But you have to be confident, of course, and that's what we're trying to teach you. I'm teaching you how to get out of it, not how to get yeah. into it. Get the idea? Yeah. Traffic Murray Bridge, Jabbery 5246, uh, five miles to the uh, east, at 2,500 inbound estimate circuits in uh, four minutes, Murray Bridge. So that was...
was just a, an introduction to stalls. Yeah. So next lesson, I would suggest we'll teach you stalls, right? I just want to get you a feel for what it felt like. Yep. Yep, you're using your feet nice out. You feel that? That's good. And we're now led down to 1,500. We want to come down to 1,200. Yep. And we want to stay at 1,200. Okay. So now we're going up. That's it, so we can pitch it forward a little bit. That's it. Look at your hand, lovely and relaxed now, isn't it? That's good. Traffic, Murray Bridge, Jabbery 5246, joining midfield crosswind uh, 19, Murray Bridge. Just in case we need them, okay? Yep. So to, what we're going to do now is we're going to do a low pass along the runway, just to get you feeling what the runway looks like, okay? Yep. So I'll do the first one, but you can come with me, right? Keep your hand on top. No, you're in control, Phil. So I'll tell it. When I take it back, I'll tell you. Okay. Uh, otherwise, you're, otherwise we get confused, don't yeah. we? Yeah. Going again or not yet? No, not yet, no. A little bit further. Runway. So we start again, I'm doing 70 knots. Yeah. Nice and smooth, nothing rushed. I've got to get myself lined up on the runway again. It's at the beginning of like that circular bit at the beginning of the runway. I'm watching my speed, I'm going a little bit too fast. I can slow it down. What is the speed? Sorry? What is the speed that you should go? Um, I'm going a bit fast at the moment, I want it at about 70 knots. Oh. A bit hard today with it bouncing along. Never rush the landings, nice and smooth. So, okay. So you tell me when the runway goes wide in your in your mind. Oh. That there, yep. Mm -hmm. That's the time when we start to fly along the runway. Okay. We just use a little bit of power, play with it, no rush to land. Oh, but we'll touch the ground, that's okay. Wings level, that's good. Up we go. When we get to 1,200, attitude, power, trim. Yep. Attitude. Yeah. So get the attitude raised about there, yeah? Bring the power back to 2800. And then trim it. I hold it there, that's a trim here. Then we're going to do a 90 degree turn to the left. Traffic Murray Bridge, Jabbery 5246, downwind 19, Murray Bridge. these green circles here? Yes. That's when we normally turn to the left. So my aeroplane, but I want you to come with me, right? Yes. Aeroplane. Aiming point? Yep. Doing 70 knots, we'll just bring the power back a little bit now, we've stopped the turn. I'm looking at the windsock, see how it's pointing out this way now? Yep. So we might have to change the other runway now. Are you telling me when it goes wide again? About now? Yeah. So that's why we just start to fly along the runway. And then just... We land. We take off again. Bit of power? Not too hard. That's fine. Well this will be a first. There you are. Lumpy. Bumpy, this this yeah. runway, so just be wary, which is quite okay. But it is lumpy. Full flaps.
there's the first. I've never done that before. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Not, usually the other way. Yeah. We always come the other way, yeah. But you have to fly into that small hole. Remember I told you that this morning? Yeah. That's how I remember it. See that? Sorry, bridge traffic, yeah. Gabaroo 491. That's what we did. One is one zero miles to the southeast, 4,000. We're inbound, estimate the uh, circuit, seven minutes, traffic main bridge. Traffic Murray Bridge, Jabbery 5246, backtracking 09 for Bravo, Murray Bridge.